In this video, I'm going to demonstrate a true diaphragmatic breathing. Now, most of you who have neck pain tend to have what we call a chest breathing pattern, meaning when you breathe in, the chest rises up, we mean going north first, and you end up using a lot of your front neck muscle to do this kind of breathing. So to correct that, I usually suggest you to put your hands way right around the lower part of your ribs. And you want to feel for what we call the east-west expansion of the lower rib cage as you breathe in. So we look something like this. As you breathe in, you will see the lower rib cage, or you should feel the lower rib cage putting push your hands away, east and west. And as you fill up air, you should see the rib cage have a movement sideways like this, and then it will rise up a little bit up north. That's a good diaphragmatic breathing. So one more time, as you see my hands to mimic the rib cage movement. So as you breathe in, lower rib cage go east and west, and you are going to fill up air all the way up to the top of the lung, and that's why you will see a little elevation. So from the side, you should not again see this kind of shoulder shrugging as you take a deep breath in and out. So one more time, breathing in, you should see a sideway with some very, very little move, upward movement at the very end of the inhalations. And from here, make sure in exhalation is full. And we usually recommend about two to three counts quietly in through the nose. And about four to five counts through the mouth on the way up. And for most of you, really trying to focus on the exhalation because at the end of the day, how much air you can breathe in depends on how much you can exhale out. And same movement at the rib cage, you need to be observed is as you breathe out, can you get your rib cage back to the center line? And for those of you who have low back pain as well, you want to see can you get your ribs actually downward as you breathe out? And that's very important, which in another video, we're going to talk about how to brace the core while keeping the breathing.